And when we talk about anticipatory anxiety, right, this notion of there is a, a pervasive anxiety. Mm -hmm. We don't know how long it's whatever it is, is going to go on. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't know when it will end. We don't know what the, the long term consequences are. When you couple anticipatory anxiety, like in a nervous system that is already primed for stress, can you talk about that and then how a spiritual solution might be a remedy for that? So what's happening in the brain when we are, we're always predicting and sort of, you know, trying to plan for the future in terms of survival at minimum. In the good days, we will be able to do that for thriving, not just surviving. But in that scenario, obviously, it was actual physical and mental survival. So to protect us, the hippocampus and the amygdala, so the memory part of the brain and the emotion part of the brain, it's almost like they gang up and produce imagery of all the times that things have gone wrong in our life to, to stop us from taking risks. So we really have to be able to override that to thrive in life. 